I think. <laughs> I like how you all immediately started listing um, ways trees could die. It must have gone about how you'd expect. He was given direct orders to return to the front, but when he refused to soil his hands again, they cast him to the downside. Here he gained the notice of the Nightwings, and before long he grew to be one of the finest rights conductors anyone had ever seen. He was instrumental in the liberation of his companions, whose roles in the Triumvirate were later filled by Erisa and me. I think trees would like to soil their hands. But um, tss. In time, Oralexo an opportunity for freedom had come up. He longed for it, so that with his exalted status, he might stand a better chance of negotiating peace. However, on the evening of his liberation, well, you know the story from that point. Volfred breathes a heavy sigh. He and I were kindred spirits for a while. I could not bear to think that he was gone. And now... I still cannot entirely believe that he is back. He is our adversary now. Transformed. Grown cold. Still, part of me is happy that he lives. Trying to tell me how to do a but I'm, I'm going to keep doing it the way I've been doing it my entire life. I'm sorry, Rag. I am set in my ways. The true Volfred Oralek love triangle? OT3! Make no mistake, of course. I shall not be swayed against our plan. Not by Oralek or by anyone. As I have said before, we share a higher calling now. As for Oralek, he wants his freedom still, although I wonder if he remembers why. You can't teach an old streamer new tricks. I mean, I've been streaming since... I think it's either November or December 2015. Like... And I only just got around to putting on a face cam, as is industry standard. I am slow to adapt. Anyway, was there something else, my kin? Nope, sorry, bye. We're done. We ran out of question options. You bid Volfred a good afternoon and leave him with his memories. It's been two full years almost. Christ, that's weird. Jeez, I hadn't actually, like, added up the time. My pleasure, Rita. Reflecting on the past from time to time helps demonstrate how far we've come, yet how much further we have yet to go. You know, our introduction was rocky, but I'm really starting to warm up to Volfred. It's fair though, I've thought about streaming sometimes and it's not like I'd use a face cam. Like, I'm still super, like, dubious about a face cam. Like, <laughs> I have to admit I'm really enjoying today and I I'm glad I at least tried it. And of course, I'm glad I got to show my cat to all of you. Extremely important considerations. But I'm not a traditionally attractive person. It can cause a lot of hassle from randoms on the internet. Uh, and there's always that worry ticking over in the back of my head. So I, I, I get it. And I think I'm probably going to continue doing the face cam for as, like, as long as I can. But, um, it, it's very much like a, a we'll see how it goes thing. I would like a better lighting setup if I am going to keep doing it though. Like, I keep looking at myself in the camera and I'm like, my entire complexion depends on whatever color my screen is at the moment. Uh, anyway, slug market. 
like randoms on the internet also hassle traditionally attractive people, so it's not like you really win. That is a fair point. True. Um, I guess what I really mean there is I am particularly susceptible to being harassed about my appearance because it's something that has Mmm. Been a thing that's happened a lot in my life. Also, you guys are very sweet, thank you. Uh, flies. Um, hey guys. So, like, I don't know what's going on up there with all them stars all acting real weird and stuff. But let me tell you something here. Market slug! You ain't gonna find a better deal on all this stuff from anybody. I mean, ANYBODY in the downside. You can trust me when I tell you that, okay? So go ahead, stock up. Yeah, it's an ongoing weak spot you'd rather not get hit with a hammer. It's true. That That's basically it, yeah. Obviously I can't speak for anyone else, but I think you look super cute. Ah! Punch the microphone. That is what happens whenever I complain about punching the microphone, by the way. Now you know. Also, like, what I was trying to do is art with hands, it doesn't really work. But you get the idea. I would play the version of this game where you get Falcon Ron in your triumvirate. That would be interesting, but like, I don't know if I could keep up the voice that long. Oh my god, there are so many of these things. The Grant's Hope. For the next right. Next right. Next right. I mean, that seems pretty good, but let's be real, we're getting rid of all of our exiles soon enough anyway. The bands are still super cute. Wait, where did I get this money from? Didn't I only have 18 last time? Did it just give me money? Falcon Ron and his dad dress up in a one robe kids in a trench coat style. That would be cool. What if you got like two aura casts but everyone's just like, clearly this is just one person. You did one of the imp challenges without noticing? What? Anyway, I'm still not going to buy anything. Uh... Handful of stardust. I could. Wait, where did I get this money from? Ash, who is so good at mercantile concerns. They wanted you to banish people's head when last right, and you did, and they gave you money. Ha! Nice! I actually did something! I'm competent! But yeah, I'm still not gonna buy anything. Bye, Falcon Ron. Didn't see nothing you like this time, huh? Sorry. Okay, well. Moving along. Once more you have gained the fall of Salayim, where one among you may go free. But first, uh, now my pop filter's blocking everything. You shall have to prevail against the withdrawn in the liberation rite. Rita. Your companions are gathered there, under the fall. They shall be counting on you. Barushta. Indeed. As the cycle of the rites turns ever faster, so too is our plan set in motion. My agents in the Commonwealth are beginning to cause a bit of a stir out there, and word has reached high places that the rites are ending. This is our chance. Though let us not despair, should victory elude us here. Pat, what are you- I hear rustling around. I just need to go check on her because... I- I'm wa-
so, so this is a but. I left my closet door open, mm, I'd say about this wide, and somebody just decided to get on in there, even though they know it is a forbidden zone, and illegal, and you are a felon. I'm touching your paw. I'm touching her paw, guys. I will allow the cat emoji spam. It can happen. Uh, you're lucky you're a cutie, Con. Really, this whole game streaming thing is just a ruse to let Twitch let Ash stream her cat? No zone is forbidden to cat? I mean, my cat would like to think that. Hey, cutie. Wanna look at the camera? You wanna say anything? I'm gonna put you down and get back to the game if you don't wanna say anything. A feline felon? Arrest this criminal? I'm glad you all are clearly familiar with cats. Well, am I annoying you? Oh, no, that's okay. Okay. Come on, felon. I know. Here we go. I put her back in the strawberry. The sentence is hugs, the worst possible sentence. Ah, oh, now my hair's all funny again. Ah. Stuck to my face now? No, good. Excellent. So is she still pooping? Uh, I haven't checked since, like, a bit before stream began. She hasn't pooped today. She did poop yesterday, which is when she had the anima, so, you know, kind of important there. I, um, I think if she doesn't poop, like, over the weekend, the next step is an x-ray to make sure that, like, the vet hasn't felt any blockages in, um, any of the, the physical exams she's given her, but, um, there could be something maybe hidden, uh, so, like, get an x-ray, see if that's causing any problems, but, um, hoping that things just settle down and that's not necessary. Please, God. We shall make the most of whatever the scribes may have in store for us. That is to say, good luck, my kin. It's time. Yes, please tell your cat to start catting regularly. It would be nice, although she, like... I can't even state how much better she's looking, like... Oh my god, pardon me. Um... This painkiller she's on is just doing so much good for her, and I mean, even if she's not pooping, she's at least eating regularly, so she's doing better in that regard and actually getting nutrition, and I, I, I'm really glad about that at least. God, I fucking love the music, like, so much. It's so good. I haven't sat down and listened to the full soundtrack yet because super giant soundtracks tend to be a bit spoilery. Spo blah, 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 blah. Spoilery? Um... But I'm actually really looking forward to finishing the game, so I can. Alodiel? Alodiel? No! That's not how English works! It's Alodiel! Please! This glorious age old tradition coming to an end upon your watch. I trust your adversaries, the withdrawn, shall not throw away this chance. Wow! Now, who may go free, should wow! Fail. I've already forgotten your name. It's like Brandon or something, but fuck you, buddy. We're making definite progress towards finishing the game. It's true. And the withdrawn of the witches. I'm, I'm sorry, the crones? Crones. The pyres burn, and each of the triumphants is present and prepared. I concur. The pyres burn, and each of the triumvirate is present and prepared. 
now that we know the voice is someone who used to be on our team, it's like extra harsh. It's true. And like he's gotten meaner and meaner over the course of the game. Then anointed one of the withdrawn. Come forth now and declare yourself and pay any respects you have unto your adversaries, the Nightwings. The bog dweller Udmild, uh, I pronounced it Udmild last time, I'm sure, appears from the shadows and reaches for her mask. I think he's just pissy we're gonna overthrow him. I mean, fair, but also no. We are known to be Witch of Milv, our adversaries. They are nothing to us, all the ones we serve. Ye all shall be devoured in the coming age, an age of strife, brought down by the fell wings and many seeing eyes of Islark, the astral born. Her music is pretty great though. Also, her claws are not the same colour as her horns. So that must mean that Bertrude does her nails, right? You speak blasphemy upon this sacred side of Mill. If you value your liberty, then I suggest you cease your mocking of the scribes. The scribes. They failed to stop Islak, and he shall rise again. As for ye Nightwings, Ye are of no consequence in Islark's grand design. She dons her mask once more. Soon we shall return unto the land of which Islark shall usurp, where we shall offer him our blood and that of many, many others. Islark is flashing the text, you make a good point. A monstrosity described in myths and ballads, fought slain by the eight scribes. Even in death, the astral born yet feeds upon our world, unsated by its own. The scribe Luce Glorian. I bet if we'd fought her more, we'd have more of an idea of her backstory. It's really interesting, like, the choices you have to make. Did they just give us negative 20 to start with? Heck! Heck off! Nightwings, your decision. On whose behalf shall you conduct the liberation rite? This game needs a new game plus where your aim is not revolution but Islark. Nice. Reader, I would ask you to choose wisely, but I am sure you know no other way. Heck you, game. Yep. And you, prepare your song, Tariq. Wow. Of course, Celeste. The lone minstrel is a sweet talker. Well, you know those bards. Okay, good. Hedwin can be anointed. Looks like it's Hedwin, Gilman, and Bertrude. Yep. Okay, there you go, Hed. This is my shot to go free. You had better not refuse this, buddy. Oh my god. But I can't just leave the rest of you. Shall be at his side. Okay, good. He, he's he's letting it happen. Sir Gilman. Like, yes you can, Hedwin. We want you to be happy. A glorious night this is far shaping up to be. Is that not so? Bertrude. Come on. Help your boy toy out, Bertrude. Then we shall do what is within our power for that one. If Edwin stays down here, he's going to get a marriage proposal from someone. He flirts with everyone. It's unavoidable. Soon is luck. Very soon we shall release thee. We shall release thee. And as for ye, Nightwings, we have much in store for ye. I don't think he even means to. He's just so nice and it happens by accident. Get out! Out! Ooh, nice jump. Yeah, suck it. Oh, I forgot that there were multiple 
Okay, let's see if we can- Oh! Too fast! No, no, no! Uh, Gilman, please. Mmm, actually... No! Illegal, honestly. Ah! I've forgotten all of the buttons. I had them before, but now that it's important... Oh, you all are too fast. Yes! Okay. Who wants to be banished first? Looks like it's you. Oh shit! Could not get out of the way fast enough. That's fine though. Just a little bit of defense. Little bit. Little bit of defense. Just a tad. Headwind. Let's go. That's fine. That's totally fine. If the no, that's less fine. Okay, two, one. I'm glad that they got the slow character to deliver the orb. Thank you. That's not fine. I forget how fast they are. That's okay. Good. Maybe I can get a gold Bertrude for once. Ah, pick up the ball! I forgot that she had the Hex of Defeat. That's helpful. Don't forget you can jump over Aura. It's so sweet that you think I'm competent. Yeah, keep jumping. You're gonna be out of stamina soon. Oh shit, she got a shot off. Excuse me. Oh boy. I thought I'd be fast enough with Gilman, but like, nope. Uh, this one, please. Oh boy. Thank you. No! Oh, that was my bad. Jesus, that's some damage, birdie. Come on. Come get some. Let's go, head one. What was our pyre at? I didn't see. We must be doing well, though, if we're getting the mid-battle uh, dialogue. Is luck. We invoke thee, for we seek thy ancient strength. 50? Our pie is at 50? That's not great. The foul our enemies within thy blood. Damnation to the Nightwings. Damnation to the Scribes. The Invocation of Islark. Your adversary Wizard Mill's curse shall summon forth dark pools of banishing Ica. Wheresoever any exile is banished. No! Oh, that's extremely rude. Would that she serve the scribes as faithfully as the monstrosity which she adores? Okay, maybe it's only where my exiles are banished? Because they didn't leave any. Uh, Gilman, just get in there. Okay, I want to bait them out and leave a nice little path for myself. Yes! Done! Ha! No problem. We're good. An outcome which left little room for doubt. It's true. Thus ends the he still cheers for us when it's people he dislikes more. I'm glad we're not literally the, the worst of the worst. Okay, headwinds going home. Nightwings shall be free. Well, I walked back in on a badass explosion. He plays favourites, but we're not his least favourite. Like, his adversary he, he should like us a bit more, though. I'm just saying. To carry out their rightful sentences. Headwind group hug? I mean, in theory, yes, but let's not. We don't want to be evaporated. Know that this affront against his luck has been recorded. And his vengeance shall darken the skies. Hedwin, you better go, bud. No saying no now. <laughs> we did it. Then I guess that means I have to go. I broke my vow to them. That we would all go free together. 
Edwin, honey! Go hug Jody! Rita, my friend. Why would we do this? Because we love you and you're precious! Kiddo! Will you ever forgive me? Fakani. Wait for me. Wait for me. He remains silent for a moment longer. Listen to me, all of you. I will not forget this. If there is anything at all that I can do back on the other side to help the rest of you, then I am going to find it, and I am going to do it. And, at the very least, I will do everything I can to make sure that by the time more of you come join me back at home, that it'll be a better place for all of us. Hedwin is too good and too pure. I can't handle this. Look, I don't have long now, so just thank you. All of you. I won't forget this. Then he plunges out of sight into the shimmer pool. His voice is audible, but growing faint. It's happening. Goodbye, my friends. Rita, everyone, goodbye. Until we see each other. The revolution percent better go up by like 80%. Yeah, we should be at like 150% by now. Hedwin earned back his freedom. He is set to return to the Commonwealth and leave the downside forever. May he return in glory. If anyone deserves to return in glory, it's Hedwin. So do we know for sure that the Commonwealth actually is a real place and isn't like the country? Apparently everyone came from the Commonwealth, which points to it being a real place. And uh, the judge is in the Commonwealth. And we do get news from there. So like, I'm leaning towards it being a real place, but I do have my suspicions. Godspeed, Hedwin. Even the judge can't shit talk Hedwin. By their grace, may the cycle of the rights keep turning for as long as possible. They're all from the shithole Commonwealth in Fallout. It's actually like, um, Fantasy Australia. It's so good. I wonder if pregnancy just doesn't work in the downside or something. I did wonder about that, like... I think that there have been natives to the downside mentioned, but I'm not sure. Okay, it doesn't look like anyone leveled Until up. Until the turning of the stars, farewell. Your chances to liberate your fellow exiles grow scarcer, but more frequent. Okay, so looks like we are going to get another chance to liberate someone, but um, who? You return to the wagon after having prevailed against the withdrawn in the liberation rite. Such the glorious night this turned out to be. Oh, clearly the imps can get it on, that's true. Would that we could make good of all such incidents. You succeeded in liberating Hedwin. He was the first friendly face you encountered at the downside, that is so rude, flavor text. He has regained his freedom in a liberation, right? Just break my heart, buddy. We have but a few such liberation rights remaining. Exactly how many I do not wish to speculate about as yet, until such time as we can better say for certain. Under no circumstances would I suggest this is ideal. However, it is opportunity enough that our plan may as yet succeed. Hedwin was worth 8%, which I think is more than anyone else has been worth so far. So, they know his value. And they'd better. So who's next? So Gilman, Pamela, or Volford? I, I just, I, I can't get rid of Gilman. I will actually die. Like, I, I'm actually, like, really enjoying being decent at the game at this moment, and only having lost one match. But, um... 
Gilman is really necessary to my strategy there. 